All right, so I got this weather station all set up. I've got the hub right here. Everything's connected. We have power going into there. We have our ethernet connected. And then we also have your temperature and humidity uh, reader right there for the indoor temperature. And of course you take this and you have a one inch hole right here. So if you wanted to put this onto a pole or a mast or something, get it up high, you can do that. And then um, I followed the quick start guide right here. It's basically four steps using the app, which was super easy. Basically, you download the app. You got to register for an account. You scan the QR code on the back of this right here. And then once it reads that with the scanner, it pops it up and uh, it's it automatically synced up with it. And I was getting data like super fast. So that's exciting. This is some of the data that I'm receiving right here. We have uh, the temperature, the humidity outside, the temperature and humidity inside. It gives me a solar and UVI, uh, the moon phases, which is super cool. And it also gets really hard to see on the, uh, on the screen. I'm trying my best. And then uh, the wind and then the pressure and the rainfall and they give you some battery information down here about it. So they give you a ton of information and you can reload just by simply scrolling all the way down like that and it'll do a reload for you. So if you wanna get the most up to date, you can do that. And then uh, there is, gra I don't have that much data right now, but there are little graphs on here. You see that little graph icon right there? You can click that and what that'll do is it'll bring up the data over time and you have daily 24 hour meteorological weekly uh, monthly yearly seven day 30 day or a custom range that you can put in so i really like that they've built that in there so you can see it over time it also gives you the sunrise time and the sunset time right there at the top corners cool to know and then uh, it's very easy to use very intuitive I uh, didn't have much problems with it. Now, I also tried to set up the web app, which there are uh, directions all for that. But whenever I downloaded it and I was trying to get it to connect to the Wi-Fi and all that type of stuff, I'm just not that technical savvy enough to be able to do it. But to have all the information right here on the phone is good enough for me. So... Uh, if y'all are looking for a weather monitoring station, a climate uh, monitor type of thing, this is definitely the one to get right here. I like how compact it is and how it comes with the built-in for the mast right here. I did want to mention that they you can also uh, replace the bottom part of this. I forget what they call it. But uh, they, in the other instructions about the weather station, it's the replaceable temperature and humidity sensor. So if for some reason you have an issue with the sensor, they give you all the instructions right here on how to uh, get that replaced. I wanted to point out, you can also get email alerts about different changes in the weather. So if you want to set that up as well, you can do that. Um, but all in all, this thing is super cool. It just runs on two AA batteries right here. I popped a couple of those into there. And uh, it's got a solar on top of here as well. So it's got the uh, energy for that along with the batteries back here. So it's just a really well-built all-in-one system to be able to track and have your own weather uh, station right at your house. So y'all definitely go and grab y'all one of these if this is something that you're looking for. I think that this would be really fantastic for people who are like, uh, you know, uh, farmers, people who deal with crops and they need to know weather patterns or people who uh, maybe travel and they need to know what the weather's like. I, I remember one time we were traveling and there was a hurricane in the area. We're down here in uh, Louisiana. And other than like watching the news or getting online and trying to figure out like what's going on, we didn't have like an exact pinpoint of our house. So something like this would have been super helpful to be able to help monitor while we were away. So y'all definitely go and grab y'all one of these if this is something that you're looking for. Let me know if this was helpful. If it was, consider adding this to your cart. Thank y'all for watching and dad out.